Are you swallowing them whole? You're eating them so fast, are they even touching your tongue? Yeah. Brownies, is that? Huh. Pastry cubes made of sugar and fat? No, thank you. I'll stick with my jerky. So why'd you come in here? To socialize and inform. Ooh, brownies! I'm taking two so I can parcel them up and eat them at my leisure later on. Much healthier. You're taking two? Yeah, um, but one of them is for Tibby. Yeah. Why don't you send that to him in Costa Rica? Um, I'm just gonna hand it to him right now. <laughs> okay, weirdo. Why is that? Why is that weird? She said she's gonna give it to him right now. <laughs> she's probably going to, because they sit next to each other. Yeah, they used to. Toby works here again. Oh, can you imagine? Oh, no. Uh, you don't know. I don't know. What? You should probably just meander back there. Take a look, see if, hmm. he's, see if he's back. Dare I? <laughs> you know what, I'm going to, for old time's sake. Great practical joke, Jim. Got me go to the annex. Oh no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Okay. Well, I did not get the job in New York. But I got the real prize, domestic bliss. Jan made me breakfast this morning. Well, she bought the milk. It's soy. This is why I do it. That's what I have to come home to. She probably won't be up for a few hours. This is going to be a very good year, very good. Jane is at home, Jim is back. My protege Ryan is at corporate. Good stuff. Um, Andy and Dwight are rocking the sales team. I feel very blessed. What about this one? It's kind of badass, right? It just seems kind of crazy in a way I might need right now. I don't know. Oh, that's not. Yours. Stanley just drank OJ out of my mug and didn't seem to realize that it wasn't his hot coffee. So the question has to be asked, is there no limit to what he won't notice? What's a seven letter word for purse? Satchel. No, starts with an H. Handbag. Hmm, thank you. All right, everybody, take a seat. As you may have heard, our branch on the planet Jupiter is up 8,000% in sales. Yeah. Hold up, my clock is slow. It is five o'clock. I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, Stanley, love you. So long, Stanley. Good night, everybody. That's no problem. Pam. Sure. Uh-huh. Pam, knock, knock. I'm on the phone. I know you are. Knock, knock. You can fax it over. Yeah, 570 555 Fly blank. 0175. Thank you. Bye-bye. It really makes us look unprofessional. They would never know it was me doing it. Here we go. Knock, knock. <sighs> Who's there? Buddha. Buddha who? Boot of the spread for me, won't you? <laughs> Great. I, I need something to wipe my head. No, there's, there's butter that on my desk. That was melting. Classic. It was a classic. I got a knock-knock joke. No. Okay. Oh, God. Michael, please, 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 please. Please let me. All right. Knock-knock. <clears throat> Who's there? KGB. KGB. They were asked the question. What the hell was that? What are you doing? What are you what doing? Are you? Hey, hey. You Stop like it. That? Stop you it. Like hey, that? come on. What are you doing? Mine is part of a hilarious joke. Mine was retribution. What are you doing? No more knock-knock jokes. That's it. Ding-dong. Who's there? KGB. 
Try to get the door. I'm not answering the answer door. Answer the ding door. Ding dong. No way. It's yeah, the KGB. Yeah, ding dong. I'm not answering that. Yes, you're going you to. answer I'm it. I'm not going to answer it. I'm not going to answer it. It's the KGB. <laughs> the KGB will fit for no one. <laughs> it's true. So, Phil recruited me to sell these cards, and now I am recruiting you. Who is this guy again? Don't worry about Phil. He drives a Corvette. He is doing just fine. Okay. Calling cards are the wave of the future. These things sell themselves. Who uses calling cards anyway? You know what? That's a nice attitude, Ryan. I'm just helping you invest in your future, my friend. This sounds like a get-rich-quick scheme. Yes, thank you. You will get rich quick. We all will. Didn't you lose a lot of money on that other investment, the one from the email? You know what, Toby? When the son of the deposed king of Nigeria emails you directly asking for help, you help. His father ran the freaking country, okay? All right, so raise your hand if you want to get rich. All right. No, um, how is this not a pyramid scheme? All right, let me explain again. <laughs> Phil has recruited me and another guy. Now, we are getting three people each. The more people that get involved, the more people who are investing, the more money we're all going to make. It's not a pyramid scheme. It is a, it's not even a scheme, per se. It's. I have to go make a call. Michael just rented the Devil Wears Prada. He has his Netflix sent here to the office and he watches them in pieces when things are slow. Steak! Where's my steak? He's a big Meryl Streep fan, so I shouldn't be surprised that he's identified with her character. Get me Armani. A suit? On the phone. Like the main company number? Because I'm gonna have to call information. Where's Armani? He's on the phone, too slow. You're not going to Paris. I'm so much better than you are. <laughs> I owe you an apology. You finished the movie. Yeah, it was awesome. Big surprise ending. Won't ruin it for you. No, go ahead. Meryl Streep is the bad guy. You never see it coming. Anyway, if I was mean in any way to you, I'm sorry. I just want what's best for you, Manushka. Makushla, he's watching Million Dollar Baby. He's gonna try to kill me.
Louie, how do we do? Well, that, that was better. Yes! 